Oh my god, this is baby Dior. And that is actually so adorable. Oh my god, baby Dior. Hey you, how are you doing today? We are gonna go shopping today. We're going to City Gate Outlets. Um, it is in Tung Chung, um, this area in Hong Kong. And there's a bunch of designer shops there that are all on sale. So I love myself a good sale. So let's go check it out. This store is called Petter Warehouse, and I had no idea what I was walking into at first, but it is so cool. It's like an outlet for Lee and Crawford, which is like a designer department store in Hong Kong. And then this is their one of their outlet locations, and they had so many pieces on sale. Everything here you see is like at least I think it was like at least twenty to eighty percent off. The shoes, oh my god. Rene Cavioli, um, you can see that's 50% off. So many shoes were at least 50% off. And they had such a wide variety too. Like I love the Rene Cavioli shoes. I have one pair of flats and I just love the sparkly bottoms. What about you? So many, so many nice shoes. And I just have wild style. Like I like everything. So like I'm picking up all the shoes that I like the most. Um, and I just love seeing sale prices. Like I am such a hunter. That one, this pair is 70% off. Literally, I was screaming at this point. I'm like, oh my God such a good deal i love these heels the block heel of the glitter it just adds so much to nothing and i've always wanted these attic i think these are from attical i've always wanted no sorry area and i do have always loved them ysl these particular heels so comfortable if they were my size i really really would have considered getting them these i love sophie webster 70 percent off i just love jewels and rhinestones i love everything sparkly i just feel like i add so much more to the shoes so i'm trying um two pairs i think this one was like 70 percent off super super soft leather um and the sparkles were gorgeous it is a 36 it almost feels a tiny bit too small and these are the Sophie Webster ones, 70% off. I did really like these too. They did feel like almost a little bit loose. And these are Gianti heels. I really, really consider these ones. These Louboutins, 90% off. 90! It was only like, like kind of like around 100 USD. Oh my gosh, I was screaming at that point and I did get something so you will see it in my next unboxing so check out our next videos that are coming up. They had a Chloe outlet and some of these styles I don't quite recognize but they did have some very very classic Chloe bags like this one and it was also 50% off and actually that ombre was pretty cute and a bunch of Chloe shoes on sale some classics like these block heels um 60 off and some flats as well i actually had a pair of chloe flats and then a steve madden look-alike and i wore them to death for years and honestly so so comfortable some of the shoes like these are definitely more seasonal but i really like that they had um classic styles on sale too I don't think Bali is as popular in North America. Um, I believe this brand is from Switzerland, um, but it is really popular in Hong Kong. So I do see it a lot. I have one pair of Bali shoes that I think I got in Italy, um, but their outlet prices are pretty good and the leather is really, really soft. So their shoes are really, really good. I don't have any bags for them, but I do have a pair of shoes that I got also on sale um, but these loafers are very classic Bali and 
it it's not big logos or anything but definitely super comfortable and just really classy nothing really caught my eye here but it's always fun to see some new eye candy and again everything was like 50% off so awesome deals for sure I really did like this the embossed croc from Marc Jacobs was my favorite and they had a Kenzo outlet I don't see Kenzo very often um, we don't have many stores in North America that have Kenzo um, the last time I've been to a Kenzo store I think was in Paris um, but they had a really good selection on sale espadrilles of 30% off very classic they have them every every season and this was the cutest mini backpack. I'm not a huge fan of the burgundy color, but I do really like that silhouette. And a lot of clothes. Do you guys know Kenzo or do you like Kenzo? I think it's just like a nice, almost like a contemporary designer brand. But I do quite like their style here. And I did pop into Coach, and they had such a wonderful selection here of limited edition tabbies. This is my favorite, favorite one, that denim one. But they had so many that were very interesting that I've never seen before. Like there's ombre, there was crystal studded um, logos right here. I just haven't seen them before. I, I know sometimes they have like limited edition variations for Asia. This was absolutely my favorite one. I just, I love denim. Um, I, I definitely want some kind of denim bag. It's on my list to get. And a bunch of other cute things. Um, Coach had decent sales. Um, this one was kind of cute. I just like the print, 50% um, off. I did really like the little strawberry collection in the mini bag trend. I still personally like like I'm not over the mini bag energy so I do still love that this reminded me of the Chanel vanity case so I feel like it was a very like affordable version of the Chanel vanity case popped into Kate Spade nothing too much to see here and also popped into Michael Kors Nothing caught my eye, but definitely a massive selection. Hey everyone, so it's my mom's birthday actually today. So we're going to go check out some cakes now um, and then celebrate her birthday. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you again soon. Bye! These are cakes. I love this one, it's my favorite one. Mimi, you go. A butter, a butter, lemon butter cream. These are cakes. Oh. Happy birthday to you.